Hey there everyone, welcome back to Splatoon Splatfest, the first one in America that I, that has actually managed to start. Um, I did a charger, like mostly charger centric uh, representation in the previous video. Now I, uh, I'm i going to be doing mostly rollers, or just rollers really. Uh, but some of you may have noticed that I actually <laughs> I ended up playing quite a few games without actually recording them. And it's too bad too, because uh, there were a few that were incredibly close. But, it's, it's, I can make some more good games right now if I want to. Uh, apparently, kind of disappointing, but Cat Champion is one rank below Cat King or Queen, and Cat King Queen is the top rank you can have. That's a bit disappointing. I was expecting there to be like 10 or 20 ranks. Cat Bed. Hmm. Oh no, wait, that, that, that's actually the name of the person. Jeez. Kind of confused me. But yeah, Cat King and Queen being the top rank is really disappointing. I was expecting it to be like Cat Jester or Cat uh, Knight, Cat uh, Prince, S stuff like that. Also, <laughs> it's been what, uh, almost six hours since the Splatfest started, and there hasn't been a rotation of maps yet a bit disappointing but it could happen actually it hasn't been six hours yet but it might still happen no wait it has been six hours never mind <laughs> it'll probably won't happen at all anyway i'm using the gold dynamo roller uh what you want to do with that roller is not uh, just hold the uh, zr but constant constantly throw ink all over the place because it charges your special really really fast and it's special is the ink strike, which allows it to target foes from great distances. So this is easily one of the best uh, rollers, if not the best roller, to use to score points. Almost guaranteed to get at least a thousand if you do it this well. Even if you lose. Ah, that Kraken is a bit laggy and unfortunately it hit me. I could have blocked it a bit, but not so. Anyway, let's see, it's already over there. I'll leave him be. He'll probably drop down anyway. Come on, I'm just trying to charge my ink strike again. Just a few more points. Oh, oh. Right over here, huh? The sub of the gold dynamo roller is a splat bomb, which isn't bad, but not amazing either. Uh, I don't know what. Ah, oh, yeah, I knew. I knew there was one behind me. I should have paid more attention. It's the same one that got me as a kraken. Super jump Over here. What, what? What? Okay, that is not... There, there's definitely a lagger somewhere, because uh, that guy just appeared out of nowhere. I'm doing surprisingly poorly right now, or it could just be that I'm facing good players, because now it's uh, 10.32, where everyone's probably, like, awake. The good players. And the bad players, too, and yeah, Dreamline right here is definitely lagging, and that player caught me. He has a Dynamo Roller. That's... They have the, the gold dynamo and normal dynamo. Both have the same stats, I think. Just different subs and specials. Yeah, I think someone caught that person. Only 33 seconds left, dang it. Uh! At least I got my revenge on that character. Yeah, dynamo roller, they get the ink zooka. Dangerous. Oh, come on. Special. Ah, really? Well, that's... Theirs? Maybe? Probably. Yeah. Okay, they just outplayed us this time. That's, that's for certain. I wasn't very lucky. My team... Faltered quite a bit. 
Cat Defender, Cat Bed was not as strong as I expected her to be. And they were just straight up better. Or ju they just straight up got lucky. Yeah, they got lucky. It's not my fault. And other various uh, words that deflect responsibility from me. I'm stuck with this team for the time being, though. I mean, I could leave them, but... They weren't excessively terrible. Just didn't quite pull it off. Alright. Here, I think we have uh, someone who's going to definitely be the splatter... Use that's definitely going to be using splatter shed. Okay. Here we have someone, a team that has a level 4 player, which means... There's definitely going to be a splatter shot junior. Or not. Guess she got some new weapons just before starting a new fight. Actually, does levels even matter here? I think they do, but... Because it's, it's not really displaying my level right now. Charge already? Jeez. I actually sent the missile directly into the enemy's base, which might not be actually a good idea. Because they're, they're, they're going to ink it over real quick. And one of the weaknesses about the Dynamo Charger is that it takes a, quite a while to charge back up your ink. Yeah, I saw you there. Carbon Roller. Carbon Rollers, they can't actually defeat you just instantly. And I managed to fire my missile at the last second there, fortunately, but... Ugh. Got ambushed. And I better not fool around. I, I don't like that I lost my first game as a Dynamo Roller. Well, my first recorded game as a Dynamo Roller, because when I was playing without doing any recording, I was quite excellent. Yeah, there was a player right down there. Now there's going to be a cat right up here, if I can just hit this right. Leave you ahead. Throw this up here. Oh, I almost caught one of those players. Oh, come on, really? Can't handle one opponent. Now they're all going behind me. I better make sure. Yeah. I think my allies just aren't straight up very good. Uh, I see you. Yeah. Sometimes enemies, they won't, like, fire when they're in this area to try to trick a player trying to, like, uh, just trying to fire and take care of on that ledge. Because they think you're looking at your map to see if someone's about to ambush you. Yep, you escaped. <laughs> that was too close. Special again. Is that my fourth ink missile? My third. I think it's just my third. It's not unusual to fire four in a single game. Maybe even five. Which is ridiculous. Some, some people never even get to use it once. Because they keep getting splatted. Anyway, yeah. That <laughs> surviving... Right down there, the last second, probably helped guarantee our victory. And I'm always going to be first right now because that's just the nature of the gold dynamo roller. Oh, and uh, I scored lots and lots of points while doing off-screen games. And you, only, you, you never get more than two extra points for the splat-tastic bonus. So even if you score, like, say, 2,000 points, you still only get two extra points for Splatastic bonus. Walleye Warehouse with a Gold Dynamo Roller. You, you definitely get your special real quick. Not sure how good that really is. Can I get a player? No, I won't. Yeah, I threw a grenade up there because I know some players like to just stand there. And there was a player right there I could have gotten, but I missed. 
Super jumping back, really? I suppose that's fair enough. Whoa, double ink missile. Double ink missile all the way. Oh, really? I missed? Gonna ink missile the same spot I'm on. Make sure I don't get ambushed. I keep throwing bombs every now and then to cover my tracks too, by the way. Lots of ink missiles everywhere here, because the uh, arrow sprays and golden dynamos, those are common weapons. And I see where that guy's going. Come on, kid! Come down here. Guess not. I can't, you can't stick around trying to get a uh, foe too often. Like, I missed him even then, again. If I focus too much on one foe, I'll eventually get splatted for my trouble. Make sure to actually, like, not get ambushed by that player, though. Bye! Aw, oh, really? He, he threw out a secret at the last second. Ah, uh, dang it. I think we have this, but anything can happen. I see you! I'm out of ink, though. <laughs> Come on! Yep, perfect timing. Uh. Come on. Ink strike. Always at the last second. It delays the game a bit, but guarantees your victory. Yeah, we definitely have this one. Urchin underpass again. I really wanted to, to show the power of the gold dynamo roller in Kelp Dome, though. Kelp Dome is a complete 100% it's a 100% map made for dynamos, Kelp Dome. Shot the ink missile in the center because there's an opponent who wants to go straight in our base right now. Don't know why. No need to be so aggressive, buddy. Also, there's a charger. Gotta be careful. Like, this isn't the charger map, but chargers... They're, they're the counter of the dynamos. Ah! Gotta escape from this. Oh, well, that was pointless. Ha! Got him. Got my ink missile. If I had time it just better. I could have probably trapped some foes right there. Got you! Oh, that's my ally. <laughs> thought it was a foe for a second there. Got you! Oh no, I missed. Come on. Well, no, wait, what? I didn't get her? How come? Huh. I guess I was just too close to the wall. Back into action. Throw a grenade. See you. No, you escaped at the last second. Throw a grenade and an ink missile. And I've got them trapped. Oh, I escaped at the last second, though. Well, this game is in uh, the bag. <laughs> oh, whoa! I, I didn't even notice that suction bomb. 
And now that I'm looking at my map, one of the players has infiltrated our base. There, take care of him. It's probably the same player who tried to aggressively attack our base back in the beginning. Yeah. Well, too bad for your adventure, buddy. It ends here. Take care of this. That's the charger. Where is he? Okay, I want to try to use an ink missile. Yep! Sometimes you'll get your special at the very last moment, and it's an ink strike, so you'll want to be prepared to fire it at the last second. If you turned it, like, activated the ink strike but didn't target anywhere on the map, I think it uh, automatically fires on your position anyway. Which isn't, like, optimal, but it's neat. Well, level 3, that means we have a guaranteed uh, opponent with a Splattershot Jr. now. Splattershot Jr. is not a bad weapon, but it's predictable, so... Oh, cool! Kelp Dome! <laughs> this is a guaranteed win, pretty much. Because I have... We got a Gold Dynamo Ruler. Uh, I mean, Gold Dynamo User. Me, and they don't. And this is why it's so overpowered, because you can do this. You can lob ink from the other side. I'm guaranteed at least a thousand points. And I fired the ink missile at a pretty bad spot or whatever. So yeah, even though... Uh oh, wait, 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 ah! Maybe I shouldn't have underestimated that uh, Spyshot Jr., but... Yeah. Spyshot Jr., they'll use their bubblers very often. I don't know why that guy was using it there. Maybe he actually splatted some of our friends. Oh cool, got someone with an echo locator too. That means I know to do this. It's possible to splat someone doing this. You can also, with other uh, weapons, you can just throw grenades, but... Ha, got you this time. Oh, oh, another one. Ah, uh, got him, but he got me too. Jump back to you. Uh oh, back here, huh? Yeah, when the, there's gonna be lots of players who just uh, walk uh, on the those things up there, and they're not that difficult to splat just because they can't. Like if they squid form, they drop, so they can't hide. The most they can do is uh, defeat you before... Oh, no, 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 you're not getting me. <laughs> Double splat! You'd think they have a bit better reflexes, but I guess they were a bit distracted by the fact they thought they got the... They got us. Yep. Maybe they're just not good. They don't, they're not even jumping around or anything. Yeah, they're probably just like players just trying to have a good time. Which is a bad thing, but we're here to win. Behold. Oh wait, there's a player who actually infiltrated our base. Yeah, this is what happens when player infiltrates our base. Good job! Uh oh Hmm. Didn't, you, didn't pop the special for some reason. I helped. I don't think I'll be able to use uh, one more special. Nope. I, I activated at the last second, but, well, while the game was over, but didn't have a chance to use it. This was a pretty dominating match, besides that, however. Kelp Dome again, huh? It's... it really is pretty much a guaranteed win, as long as I'm using the Gold Dynamo Roller. They, there's two other rollers on the opposing team, but they don't fire... When they do this, they don't fire as far, and because of that, they don't lob their shots as well. You can do... you can lob with any kind of shot, really, even chargers, but... The Gold Dynamo Roller just does it so well, so... 
overpowered in this stage. <laughs> Did I splat? No, it was with the ink strike, but if I had splatted someone by lobbing the ink like this, that would have been incredible. Let's see there. Got you! Ha! Just waiting for the player to untransform, and you need ambush them. You do that with all the Krakens, I feel. Ink strike. I'm just ink striking as soon as as I can by the way, which isn't the safest thing to do, but in this map you can you have so much leeway. Oh oh god surprise right there. You have so much leeway in Kelp Dome as a gold dynamo roller. You can get splatted five times a match and you'll still score a thousand points. Even if you lose. Ah, uh, dang it. Got you. Nope! Ah, uh, I hit the Kraken at the last second, but it didn't help. And because of that, I don't get to use my Ink Strike. Well, if you had the center here, you can have an easy time lobbing. Ah, uh, dang it. Careful of the Kraken. Got her. Oh, dang it, there's another one! Dang it, yeah, I forgot. There's two cr there's two crack on, splat on rollers here. And my teammates are not doing very well right now. They keep getting splatted. Uh, me too, but it's not quite as important for me because I score so many points so easily. Uh, we still have this match in the bag, I feel, but. Ugh. No, it doesn't matter if you get me, buddy. And this is... I can't tell, really. This could be a close one. Uh, yeah, it's kind of close. Didn't dominate as well as I should have, but... Just because uh, we all kept getting splatted. Yeah. We weren't doing well at all in terms of uh, not getting killed all the time in this match. We won anyway, thanks to sheer overpoweredness of the Gold Dynamo Roller, but... This win wasn't deserved, is what I feel. It's too bad all the ranked players aren't here right now. <laughs> because ranked, whether it's splat zones or um, tower control, it's a lot tougher. And I don't mean in terms of like the style of the games, it's just the players are much more aggressive. Turf War, it's like just mindless fun by comparison. I see you there, buddy. I see you too up there. Oh, now they see me. Doesn't change. Oh, just a second one. Dang it. I see what you. Ah, uh, bubbler. Won't change the outcome, buddy. Yeah, so what he was trying to do is uh, inking this. So you can jump here! Ha! Got you. Ink missile at a pretty bad spot, but whatever. There's someone climbing up here. Unfortunately, splatted my ally. I'm here, buddy! Oh! Yeah, that was too close. <laughs> See you there, buddy. Come on, I've got more reach than you guys. I really do. The Gold Dynamo Roller, more range than uh, Aerospace, I feel. Thank you. Thank you. Time to lob some more ink, which means they can't do anything. And that was an ink missile at the last second. This is definitely our win, however. Yeah, look at their measly weapons they were using. 
Aerosprays, Splattershot Juniors, Yen Zap. All short range. Well, uh, Yen Zap, I'm not, I've never tried Yen Zap, but I think it has a bit more range, but... Not, not as much as the Gold Animal Roller, that's for sure. Ah! If I was sticking to the wall like I should have, I would have been safe, but... No, I accidentally dropped off of it. I, at least I think I would, I would have been safe. Ah! Charger. Trying to... There! Got you. You cannot squid form while you're on enemy ink. Words to live by. Got you! There. Finally. Get me out of there. So much enemy ink. I was actually trying to find a safe spot. To use my special on. Ah! Almost got me there. Uh oh. Ah, I thought I was just out of range, but... Trying to get an accurate shot, huh? Ooh, dang it! There's no way I could have escaped that. I was hoping I would at least splattered one of them. Okay, so we're dying a lot, and we're <laughs> it feels as though we're doing poorly, but we're actually not. It's pretty, pretty much very equal right now. Got you! Oh, come on. Now I tried to use my ink missile at the last second there, but then I got splatter scoped. Okay, we're losing right now. I have to make a last ditch uh, effort move right there. I even threw a splat bomb at the last second because if I had tried to use my basic attack, it wouldn't have worked. Anyway, this this is going to be close. Oh! If I had not thrown that splat bomb, we might have actually lost. Every second counts. Even fractions of a second count. And yes, that charger was definitely good. Kudos to that. Okay, okay. Uh... I was listening to the sound uh, test minigame and there were three or four tracks that were like blurred out uh, when you originally unlocked it a while ago. Now the, tra the other tracks have been unlocked and it's basically the variant of uh, different musics that you can listen to while playing this. It's the different variations uh, of the match songs that you get uh, while playing in Splatfest. You guys can hear them right now. Got I splatted someone with the ink strike. Feels oddly satisfying when you do that, even though it's uh, probably an indication that a player got really unlucky. Yes, double splat. Just gonna wait. <laughs> Approach if you dare. I see you right there, buddy. Oh. Ah, uh, well, I got the guy that was up there, but then, uh, I didn't check. I, di I got flanked. Hmm, didn't catch that player. Inkzuka? I think he has the Inkzuka. That player did not notice me. Myra Kart 8, that's his nickname. Why would you choose such an odd nickname? Uh, 
Nah. Gotta go back to over here. Because someone is about to infiltrate our base. I see you there. Bye bye. Yep. That was a synchronized strike to ensure they had no way to escape. That's something you can do using the ink missiles. Ah, oh, come on, someone infiltrated our base anyway, probably because he was using the bridge. Almost splatted him. Ha! Got him, at the last second. Uh, this looks a lot... Well, it's not... It's gonna be our win, but... Doesn't look as uh, dominating as it was a while ago. Maximum. Cat Queen. Well, <laughs> so much for ranking up uh, again. Uh, I believe if uh, your team wins and you have maximum rank, you get like 24 Super Sea Snails? That's amazing. Well, I guess uh, I'll, I'll, I'll change weapons after this match. You know, to show the other varieties of... Uh, Charger and uh, no, rollers you can use. Some of them, anyway. Oh, come on. Didn't I catch that person? Dang it. I had everything planned, but I, I the opponents uh, kept uh, escaping my grasp. Got you. Well, apparently, no. And that turned out poorly, but at least I got the opponent. Booyah! Ha! Perfect splat bomb. Thir triple kill, yes! But where is the opponent that has the gold animal roller? Bye-bye! Ah. Didn't get any of them. Well, with the ink missile, anyway. Ooh. Going deep inside the enemy base. Ah, jeez. My aim is not very good right now, and... Too many foes have infiltrated our base, so I better just stick on defense right now. Someone's hiding right there. You saw it? <laughs> trying to catch us off of us, uh, trying to catch us off guard. Even I did that a few times. While I warehouse, I feel it's probably one of the best maps. And that was a lame attempt at ambushing us, buddy. Bye bye. Didn't catch the gold dynamo roller. She's lagging a bit, I think. Huh? Terrible. She's actually really, really good. Um, we actually might lose this because someone forgot to ink a. Uh, our side uh, that anchors out. Yeah, dang it. Lost by 3%. Well, kudos to the enemy gold dynamo roller because she was playing really, really well. Or not. Apparently, I just wasn't like splatting her as often as I expected. Crack on splat roller. Well, kelp dome with something, a roller that is not the gold dynamo. That should be decently interesting. Everyone's using the crack on, jeez. Anyway, yeah. You can attack much faster, but you you cannot fire your ink nearly as far as you could with uh, the gold dynamo, so 
You're gonna be spending most of your time just moving around. Is that person lagging, seriously? Right from behind, buddies. Oh, dang it! Last second, I could have got her. There. Come on, drop down, buddy. Ha. Oop. Got to charge back on ink. Where's the enemy, anyway? Well, there's one right there, but... Hmm. Oh! Dang it. Missed her again. Where are you? I guess she moved someplace else. She was right. Actually, she thinks she was trying to ambush me, but she missed. <gasps> Got you. Ha. Uh oh. You're not gonna catch me. Got you. Ah. Come on. I'm right behind you, buddy. Squiggity, squiggity, I'm coming for your booty! Dang it! Got one someone's booty, but not yours. There, finally got you. <laughs> uh, we're doing kind of poorly right now. Ha ha ha! Double kill! Oh, dang, come on. How could I miss her? <laughs> there, yeah. Thankfully, that wasn't an instant kill because carbon rollers, uh, they're weak like that. They trade lots of speed for lots of their offense. 10 kills. That's the true nature of the crack on splat roller. Uh oh. <laughs> That's a shame. Four against three. I've never been on a team of three against four. It seems to happen to only Team Dog, and that kind of insinuates that there's more cat players than dog players. Doesn't it? Uh, why is that person following me? It's not inking anything by following me. Word of advice, if you're using a roller, don't follow another roller. Especially if that other roller is inking. Ah, got you. Ooh, wow. He turned around really fast. You know, I've thought about... <laughs> I've actually thought about not doing anything, you know, to make it fair against the, play the three players, but... That, that would not be, like, that would probably piss off my team, you know? Oh, wow! That's weird. Yeah, yeah, I see you. Ah! Uh, everyone got splatted. Okay, these players definitely aren't very good. They haven't they haven't even inked all their base. So it's probably because of their connection, I guess. And now there's a player deep inside the enemy base that's just decimating them. My goodness, JF King. Can we stop doing this? We can have our own little splat fest sometime later, okay? And that was my fault. Slow reactions, buddy. Oh, someone's uh, actually... Well, thankfully my team member got him, but... Got you! And this time you didn't splat me in the process. 
Ha! <laughs> tried to use an ink strike at the last second. But they caught us at the last second, so this is probably gonna be 80% against uh, 10. Ha! Called it. But yeah, that, said, that certainly was not fair. Four against three, and they weren't even that great. So, kind of feel sorry for Team Dog. It's like, I feel like I'm kicking them right now. Kicking them while they're down. Just a bunch of virus sprays. That includes the splash matic by the way. And jeez, Ohai, stop following me. No, you come on. Stop following me. Ooh, that was too close. Okay, camera was really bad here. You can run, but you can't escape. Unfortunately, you splatter me at the same time. Uh, someone's entering our base. Two people up, actually. Two squids. Three squids, actually. They're all trying to infiltrate our base. Got you. <laughs> what do you think you're doing, buddy? Chill. Any other ones? I don't think so. Oh. We're going down. Better hide. And, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I've never used them, but I can put... Oh, uh, really? I think I accidentally hit her while she was squidding. You can put squid beacons on while using the crack on the splat roller. So you're all gonna appear up there, huh? I can easily splat you like this. And then... I can do this! Come on down! Come on down! Ah, he's up there. Ah, uh, okay, that was well played. Well defended, well placed. They knew what they were doing. Booyah! Straight to the ink strike. Dang it, I keep thinking I still have splat bombs. Um. Gonna have to ink over the one who's trying to infiltrate our base right now. I know you're there, buddy. Um, yeah, we definitely won this, but uh, not as w we didn't perform as well as we should have. Okay, you know what? Time for another weapon. Yep, I think I'll use the Ink Rush. It's not really a roller. Well, actually, it is a roller. It's just that it, it's just that it's much more different than the basic rollers. There's actually not that many rollers in this game. I I, I kind of forgot about it. Like my only other choices are the Dynamo Roller, the Splat Roller, and the Carbon Roller. So when you uh, just hold the fire button using the Ink Brush you'll travel very, very quickly across the ground. But you won't ink very much. Like, just look at this. You're moving really, really fast, but you're not inking very much. If you want to ink, just keep pressing the ZR and you'll ink the area around you. Not as efficiently as you can, however. Your, your attacks do not deal that much damage, by the way. So careful. And I'm just, I'm just gonna go straight into the enemy base and keep trying to splat as many foes as I can, by the way. Too bad. Oh, I used the special at the last second, however. Thank you. There. The sub-weapon of the ink brush is the sprinkler. 
just put it somewhere and it starts sprinkling the place. Oh, dang it! Got unlucky right there. If you die or get splatted, the sprinkler that you uh, set in place will, will have broken. And if you set a new one, the old one will also break. Um, uh, the ink strike is something you should use to set up an, uh, an offensive, I feel. <laughs> Double kill! And fortunately, I think I'm gonna get splatted, yeah. Because I got too greedy. Actually, I think you might actually move faster while trying to ink. Got you, finally. No, it's Stranger 2, yeah. Can I reach you? No, I cannot. Oh, I, I can barely, but not enough damage. Better super jump, actually. Bye bye! Need escape. Uh, need to defend. Oh, great. Dang it, I thought I was just out of the way, but not quite. That guy's using the killer whale really well. Booyah! Nice view of the base, but... Well, we definitely won. Not as well as we should have, however. Yet again. I think I keep getting stuck with enemy teams that have one good player, but uh, a bunch of terrible ones too. Ten kills. Not very much ink uh, spread around, however. The ink brush is really, really fun, but I don't particularly recommend using it in uh, ranked matches. Of course, unless you're confident you can make it work, I guess. Bye-bye! <laughs> strike to the ink strike. Perfect. Oh, dang it. Gotta be careful. Dang it. My aim was not very good. Well, got one of them. I noticed at the last second that one of them was hiding there. But two against one? No, no way I could win that. Really? Well, at least someone was behind to take care of him, but... I think I, you actually have to aim when you're using the ink brush in front of someone. Make sure to be looking straight at them and not like just randomly swatting the air around you. Yeah, there was another one. Anyone waiting? Got you. Time to escape. Shot the ink strike straight on my position. Which didn't catch him, but caused some damage. Booyah! Are we missing a player? Yeah, we actually... It's actually... Three against three right now. We're missing a player. Uh, actually, uh, are they missing two players? No, they got three players too. Okay, it's three against three right now. I was wondering where 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 was one of our teammates? It's Aaron, the uh, one with the splat roller that uh, got destroyed. Chew. You can take advantage of your speed to outrun uh, enemy shots by, her, by the way. That's one of the advantages of using the ink brush. I've never... The only time I've ever gotten disconnects myself is during Turf War on... Uh, not on Splatfest. I've never gotten a disconnect on Splatfest, but basic Turf War. I've never gotten disconnected in uh, Ranked, luckily enough. People keep saying that it can happen, however, which uh, concerns me greatly because Ranked is... Uh, like, your current rank is not that important, but 
You get better rewards for having a higher rank. I'm currently A rank. Still haven't quite reached A plus just yet. I haven't tried. But I get like 4,100 uh, coin every time I win a match. Well, if I was, let's say, B minus, it would be less than 3,000. Or roughly 3,000. Also, a good spot to put a sprinkler is right in the beginning because it, it uh, fires on all the spots here. Oh, really? You're just hiding in your base? What's wrong with you? Got you. Careful. <laughs> that guy was not aiming right. Somehow. Everyone keeps skip spamming come on. But come on should only be used when you actually want your teammates to go where you are. And let me try to throw the sprinkler up there. Did I get it? Yes. I managed to get a sprinkler up there, but it got destroyed. Bye-bye, buddy. Well, I got him. And the ink missile was shot. That's all. That's what counts. But I... Yeah, the ink brush is really good for surprise attacks. Don't know what that Brent is doing. Ha! Got him. Oh, oh. Dang it. Well, that was pretty dominating. Were they missing a player? I think so. Or they were just really, really bad. I mean, look at those two carbon rollers on their team. Seven and eight times defeated. My goodness. I'm on a team of arrow sprays. I feel so dirty. Where's the style in the arrow sprays, anyway? And those guys are just straight and heading straight for the center, which isn't a bad strategy, but... Put a sprinkler right here. Okay. Missile right over here. Why was I not hitting him? I guess I, I need to be on the middle ground with them. And that Matthew kid is just uh, staying on our base right now. Careful of foes that are super jumping to you. They, they get a small chance to do something and sometimes they'll throw a splat bomb which can end you. Okay. Ink missile. Bye bye buddy! Ugh! Ambush! Dang it. Didn't manage to squid form uh, to escape. My allies took care of pretty much everything though. Yep. Booyah! Okay, stop doing come on. We're clearly winning here. Ah, almost had the ink missile. Uh, I don't think I'll super jump to uh, my friend right there because middle of the firefight. Oh, dang it. Just escaping right down here. And 
that is... Yeah, that's definitely our win. A bit closer than I wished it was, however, because if I got splatted at the end there, it definitely would have been their win. Ha ha ha! That's what you get, Carbon Roller! Can't fire shots that are damaging enough to defeat me. Ah, oh, dang it, I'm out of ink. Ooh, that was too close. Just trying to go up there so I can properly start spreading the ink around and... Connection seems a bit bad here. I might... Oh! Nice killer well dodge there. Courtesy of this basic splat roller. It's dad. I faced mom before. Now I have to face dad? How come? Okay, I'm coming, Maple. I'm just pissed off you keep uh, losing, don't you? Yep, just going straight ahead to defeat that person. We're actually losing. We're actually losing. Yeah, we're actually losing right now. So. Ah, that was just brutal. Oh, dang it! That's this, it's because one of our players got disconnected. That's why. Yeah, I was I was feeling that the connection was a bit. Uh, Four at some point and what do you know so we're likely gonna lose this just because it's three against uh, four <laughs> this is what they get this is what they get for trying to put to, to, to clean up the mess I made with my ink strike Ah, uh, I should have made sure I was back at 100% though. And we're, we're definitely not going to win. At least I don't... No, no there's definitely no way because they shot an ink strike at the last second. But yeah, three against four, there's pretty much nothing you can do. Sometimes when the team is bad enough, you can win. But most of the time, it's just like you get overpowered. In sheer number. Well, three, three of them just decided to go through there. Huh. What can your squiffer hope to do against me, buddy? Well, that was strange. <laughs> that's that's basically like what, what every fight against two ink brush opponents is gonna look like, though. But really, I think that guy's lagging a bit because uh, he kept firing attacks even after I defeated him. Go back home. And yeah, that is definitely our win. Especially considering the amount of damage I was able to do uh, in the enemy, enemy home base. I think I've given the ink brush enough love now. It's a very fun weapon to use, but not very... Like, it's not... It's not excellent. I performed well with it, but it, it, against players that know how to play, the Ink Rush uh, has too many KVATs to really be something that's great. But it's very fun to use, that's for certain. Okay, actually, I'm running out of time. It's almost two hours, so 
I think for the last weapon, I'm gonna use the... Well, Hero Roller Replica, but that's basically just a splat roller, just a, uh, a little different. There's still the Dynamo Roller and the Carbon Roller I could have used, but I don't really feel like using the Inkzuka or even the Echolocator. So, Carbon... Uh, Hero Roller... Hero Roller Replica Roller it is. I'm, I'm just using the replica because it's fancy compared to the basic splat roller. My goodness, we're a team of rollers! Except for that one player with the arrow spray. Oh, the basic roller is pretty bit basic. It's not like the Kraken which uh, can be used for many kills or anything like that. You just have to be aware of your surroundings to use a basic roller properly. And make sure to know how to use the killer well. Dang it. Oh yeah, and we have suction bombs. I forgot about that. Ha! I managed to get someone with the killer whale. Ah, uh, really? Yeah, there's blasters. I've never used those before, but... Blasters are excellent in tower control, that's for certain. Oh, uh, really? Okay, this... <laughs> I need to stop using the Hero Roller Replica as uh, something that's like the Dynamo Roller, because it clearly is not. Ah. Uh, and the blaster is excellent at uh, catching players that are trying to hide behind corners, as it was shown right there. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm no good at trying to deal with these opponents with my weapon right now. So... Go in here. Ah! Almost had him. <laughs> Bad move, buddy. Okay, and that's a lagger. That's for certain. And there's a player inside our base right now handling all three of our teammates. Jeez. I was out of ink. Well, <laughs> that was not... It wasn't going to work out because uh, the enemy team, or one of the enemies, managed to get all the way inside our base, even inking our spots. This is what happens when you have a team of multiple rollers, though. You keep, you keep, there is such a thing as having too many rollers. That also doesn't help that I wasn't very good and... <laughs> Another one of my teammates also wasn't very good. Well, now we have two rollers, and they're both different types, so maybe this won't be as bad. Okay, let's see if I can use this well. Oh, they're right there? Ah, that was a bad move on my part. Because you keep, I keep thinking, oh, I'll be able to escape in time. I can push him back, but I'm not using the weapons I'm used to using all the time right now. So, ah, uh, finally, jeez. There, finally. Hey, I think I'm hitting the... Finally... Oh, dang it! I, I was about to say, I think I'm finally getting the hang of my weapon, but... My, it, it simply is also because uh, my teammates... Are having trouble themselves, and I said we were only uh, uh, two rollers, but there's also a paintbrush user, which is effectively the same thing. Let's be honest. And the, that guy is lagging. I think he's lagging. Anyway, I think this is our victory. Oh, less than one percent. Our victory, but just barely.
Okay, I only have time for one more match, but I don't think I can do it with these guys because there, there's it's simply too many rollers. Gotta find a more varied team. Well, two rollers, that's not so bad. <laughs> you fell for my trap! There we go. Oop, out of ink. Now... Did I catch anyone? No, unfortunately I did not. Ah. There. N nice job, buddy. You were supposed to handle that guy. Just hiding, letting me do it for you. Nice shield. Okay, you know what? It's time to attack aggressively. Uh, well, can you do anything? No. Special Matic reflects the, cra the Kraken really easily. He got apparently he got him at the last second though, so. <laughs> Nowhere to run. Oop. Dang it. Aero sprays seem to counter the basic roller really easily. Quite an unfortunate fate for it. Oh, really? Come on! Right in front of his face, but because he's using the splash o matic he easily deflects me. Yeah. I think I screwed up my suction bomb at the end there. It, it attached to, uh... It attached to uh, an object, and because of that, it, it didn't, like, create as much uh, ink on the ground as it should have. Uh, you know what? One more, until I win, anyway. Gotta show that the hero ro roller replica is not that bad of a weapon. It'd also be better if I didn't have to face arrow sprays all the freaking time. Uh, team of rollers. I'll deal, whatever. Hopefully this won't end too badly for me. Too bad! I used it the last second though. <laughs> you go oh come on I almost had him and that player is not paying as much attention as she should yeah she's definitely not paying that much attention to her surroundings and because of that we're actually winning right now. Huh. This has to be the most uh, expected comeback. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, actually, they threw an ink strike at the last second there, so it might be theirs. Yeah, dang it. Uh, I'm not stopping until I can win. Also, team of three rollers, seriously. Come on. Not gonna show up, buddy? Finally. There. Just have to be patient. Ha ha ha! Got the one oh oh wait wait wait. Oh frick. He got a gold dynamo. Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> Just gotta be patient. Trying to get me with a seeker, huh? And he 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 actually ran out of a uh, ink fire. What? How did I not? Ah! Uh, the power of gold dynamo at your service. <laughs> okay, you know what? This is a win in my book. Just because I caught that player so many times. And that was pointless for me to do that at the end, but I just felt like it. So yeah, there was no way we could win that because against a gold dynamo roller, it just can't really happen. So yeah, I know the hero roller replica can be a good weapon, but not when you're with so many other rollers. You just can't make magic happen when you're, you're playing with so many other rollers because there's too little variety in wh how, how many sa situations you can handle. Your team, rather, can handle. So yeah, that, that's it. That's it for the rollers. Next time I'm going to be using uh, all the uh, shot weapons, the automatic weapons, whatever they're called. So hope you all enjoyed this video and hope you all have a nice day. There's more stuff in uh, for Splatoon, tips, matches, and... Uh, Splatfest stuff in the playlist below. Bye-bye!